I'd start out the vlog here in the car. It's super rainy and gross out. And I think this car, no, I thought this car was about to park right beside me. And I was like, gonna have to go. Um, but I'm at the doctor's office today. It's 3.30. My appointment's at 3.40. So, um, I'm starting out the vlog at 3.30 in the day. But I'm sorry. <laughs> I worked this morning and that was good. Okay, this I think this car may be coming back to park here. I don't know. Anyways, I can just grow up and talk to the camera. Um, so I am 29 and 3 days or 4 days. Almost 30 weeks. So I don't know what appointment this. I don't really know what's to do at this appointment. Probably absolutely nothing. So whatever. That's fine. <laughs> so um, I'm just going to go to this appointment and then go back home and vlog what I do for the rest of the day or maybe the rest of the week maybe this will be like a couple days of my life it's Tuesday but I kind of have a busy week I have like something every day up until the weekend and then this weekend is one of my baby showers back home so that'll be fun and maybe I can like show y'all what I end up wearing because I I ordered this dress yesterday which I'm obsessed with it but I don't even want to tell you how much I spent to get it shipped within two days like i'm just right want to throw up so it better fit because if it doesn't fit i'll clearly have to send it back but i'll lose all that money that i spent on shipping but anyways that's my fault i shouldn't have waited till the last minute anyways oh i need to drink my water because if i don't have to pee when i get in there that's gonna be really bad also might go to um the grocery store after this so maybe i'll do like a little bit of a grocery haul i don't need much but everybody's talking about not everybody but tiktok because like i'm on overnight oat tiktok and i want to try it so bad but i've heard it's so gross to some people but i don't know why that intrigues me to want to try it so badly but it does so i might get stuff to make that i honestly have everything to make it except milk because i never keep milk because it goes bad but i think if i buy like organic or something the date lasts longer we'll try it and see but anyways i'm gonna quit rambling on before this is like a five minute intro and go into my doctor's appointment and i think i think today i will schedule my 4d someone okay so apparently i'm supposed to request one you don't just naturally get one so we'll see i'm not really sure i'll update you on how that goes home from the doctor's office Mally's always chilling in the floor, but I've literally already had a shower and I'm in my pajamas. And there's toothpaste on my shirt. Um, but I just made these um, overnight oats, so we'll see how they go. They look disgusting, if we're being honest, and they're probably going to be. But, um, yeah, it's just rolled oats, almond milk, cinnamon, vanilla. I did a TikTok on it is the reason I didn't show it on here. So sorry. <laughs> but um and peanut butter so i think that might save it but to be honest it doesn't look that great but i mean it's worth a shot and the only thing i had to go buy was almond milk so and i'm gonna um eat that tonight with my cereal which let me show you all the cereal i got because um you can't get it anywhere but Publix, or at least around me you can't and it's my favorite cereal it's the special k protein cinnamon brown sugar crunch it's like a healthier cinnamon toast crunch it's so good and i could literally eat like five bowls of it and i just got almond milk to put to eat with it so honestly stays and i hate when you shake it and it leaks like that i don't understand you're supposed to but anyways that's probably gonna be my supper i'm like stressed about this test that's it's literally not till next monday and it's tuesday right now but this is the last test. Like, this is the final. And if I don't pass this test... Actually, like, I could literally fail the test. But I have to make a certain... <laughs> I have to make a certain grade on it, clearly. I can't just, like, make a zero and pass. But I'm, like, stressing out for no reason. But, like, anyways. I'm just so ready for this class to be over with. Also, to update you about what the doctor said. My due date is now July 10th. Which I think it was always that. And I was just misinformed. Um, and then they said I should have already scheduled my 4D. Which nobody told me. But whatever. 
so I have that Thursday which is in two days and I have like a million things going on so a little bit stressed but that's okay you can just listen to me ramble <laughs> so I have class in the morning chiropractor appointment then work then I need to come home and study for this test like the whole afternoon so this can be a super boring vlog but glad you're here with me <laughs> So, also about to eat the cereal and I wanted to show you what it looks like. It's so good. I can't even explain it. Amazing. Good morning, officially good morning. I just got back from class. I came home to change because I have a chiropractor appointment, but I did not want to sit in class in like a cute outfit. So come home because I have like maybe 20 minutes before I need to leave. So I oh, I need to get my lunchbox out of the fridge before I forget it. Um, and I'll just like um, go straight to work after my chiropractor appointment. This is my first time going to the chiropractor like ever, but my back is broken somehow. I don't know what I did to it, but I was cleaning the other day and I scrubbed the bath the bathtub and I noticed it was hurting like when I got up and I was like, whoa, like that never happens. And then I just continued like cleaning and I was mopping the floor. And like, as I was bending over mopping, I was like, ow, like that has never hurt before. So definitely going to the chiropractor and seeing if they can like give me some relief because I'm limping like a grandma but yeah <laughs> that is my update for the day pretty much nothing else going on here's my little outfit um I have a grandma style is what everybody says so let me know if you think that but I brought these um I have these loafers on with this you can't even see I don't know why I can't ever get a good angle but the shirt is from Martin's. These maternity pants are Old Navy. They're the best. And then these shoes are also Old Navy, just like some loafers. They're so cute, but they're so uncomfortable, so I will not be wearing these to work. I brought me some. I got my tennis shoes laid out right there. There's my lunchbox in my purse, but I'm going to bring that with me because ain't no way. Ain't no way I'm wearing these shoes to work because... I was like literally crying last time I wore them, so yeah. Gonna go to my appointment, then I'll update you what I do next. Update, I don't know why I'm throwing my fork in the air like this. <laughs> update, I'm home from work and I just made me a little chicken quesadilla, which I'm literally ruining my supper because it's like three o'clock, but me and Mally are gonna sit here and watch some YouTube probably, and then I need to study the rest of the evening because I don't know, I'm sure I said it on here. Um, I have finals coming up, so super pumped about that. Was gonna go get my nails done, but then I was like, priorities. We can try and go tomorrow. Probably won't, but yeah. <laughs> okay, update. It is the next day, and um. I had my appointment at the doctor this morning for my 4D ultrasound. If you remember, I don't know, I guess it was in this video, I said like, I need to probably schedule that because my doctors or nobody have brought it up and I just know that, you know, it's towards the end or whatever. So I requested it and they scheduled it for 
the same week. They were like, you need to get it this week or it's going to be too late. And I was like, I wish somebody would tell me that, but whatever. So I was like, okay, well, I can come back as soon as possible. So they got me in two days later, which was this morning. And I'm much more calm about it now. So that's why I let myself like calm down. But definitely did not go as planned. Um, I, I was so excited, literally, because I haven't had... The only ultrasound, really, I've had is the anatomy scan, which was great. We got to see everything. But my first one, I was, like, six weeks, maybe. Like, I, you could not see anything at all. And, I mean, that was good to, like, see. And I don't even think we could hear the heartbeat at that point. But So I pretty much just had one where I've seen her. And so I went in and I pay for it because it's not covered on insurance. And um, I really don't care to tell the story if it literally, even if the doctor's office sees this, like it, I'm just really frustrated. Um, I get in there and she was just very discouraging um, because she couldn't see anything. I guess the, ba she w the baby was like balled up and just this, immediately from the moment she stuck it on my belly was just very like this is not gonna work today like this is not gonna happen I just don't think it's gonna happen um she is not in a good position I literally just can't even see any like there's a difference in letting me know like hey like this is probably not gonna come out like you thought but just being very discouraging and not talking me through anything and um so then uh she eventually just said honestly if I were you I'd just get my money back and that was just like really frustrating because like, can you please, like, offer an alternative before you offer that? Because, like, I understand you don't want me to waste my money, but, like, she's just in a ball. Like, she's just not moving right now. And it's, like, in anyway, so, um, I was like, well, can we please keep trying? Like, you know, I'm already here. Like, I have to take off for things like this. Like, I'm here. So, we kept trying, kept trying. And it was just no communication, really, um... And she pretty much said, like, I don't know why you're doing it this late anyway. And I was like, well, the doctors didn't tell me that I was supposed to schedule it earlier or any of the nurses. Um, I'm, you know, literally first time pregnancy, didn't know. Don't, don't really see how that, that is my fault. But so she pretty much said, I can give you your refund if you leave right now. But if you come back and I don't get a picture even then, I can't give you a refund. And I, and I was like, even without, like, any pictures or anything, like, I understand I'm taking up your time, but it's like, can we not try again, like, or can I, like, hang out in the lobby and come back, like, I'm not, like, asking you to, like, stare at me for 24 hours, like, can we see if she's in a good position to see her, because she was just in a bad position, like, I don't understand, but, so I was in there maybe, like, 20 minutes, if that, and just i mean she's trying to get her to move which she doesn't move when you stab her and poke her she moves when you're completely still like at night she is kicking the crap out of me but then like during the day when i try and get her to move she doesn't want to move so like that's just i mean i'm sure she she can't help that like she's literally just trying her best to make her move but it was just really discouraging and then even when i checked out the lady at the receptionist and the lady she was on the phone with because i was getting my refund was like, oh, I would go here. Like, she whispered it. She was like, I would go here and they can do it for $100 and they'll get you a good picture. That's literally what she said. And I was like, how about you just like tell your employer that when I'm already here to do that? I'm like, I'm so confused. You just referred me to a different office. Like, I'm so confused. But anyways, I am... Oh, and then I went and got my nails done because I was, like, literally tore up afterwards. And I was like, I need some self-care. So, I went and got my nails done. I just got, um, I finally figured out the name of it today. It's called White Bunny. If you ever want to get it, it's literally just a white. Like, I don't, there's no cream, like, anything. It's literally just white. It's not as, like, it's a little opa more opaque than just plain white. But, it's pretty much white. You can just do white with, like, less coats and it would be pretty much the same but i'm in the food sockley's drive through right now because i wanted chicken fingers I actually wanted bojangles like really bad but it's like 17 minutes away and this is closer and i was just like i'll settle for it to be honest but i really wanted bojangles but here we are and i've had no water today 
and I can tell and I'm like really scared I'm gonna get sick so I'm gonna order like a large water and chug it even though I hate getting like water out of the fountain or whatever they get it but anyways I've been talking for like six minutes and I thought this was gonna be a lot more of a dramatic clip because I was really upset earlier but I'm really glad that I didn't just cry just now because I mean, I'm, I'm not getting another ultrasound until she gets here, pretty much. Like, that's pro pretty much the, the bottom line. Like, I can go to a boutique or something and get it, but I really just wanted... I really wanted to do it at my doctor's office. I just felt more comfortable, and that's just what I wanted to do. So, oh well, it's not the end of the world. I'm a little bit dramatic, and I need to figure out what I'm getting. OMG. Okay, I'm going to get the bigger box if you're from Fusakli's. Oh wait, yeah, it's 8.49. It probably has a lot in it. I probably should get the snack, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> okay, thanks for listening to my rant. I hope it wasn't too dramatic. I hope it didn't bring you down too much. But it's just real life today. So yeah, I've got to work later. And then there's like this thing on campus, like a movie night on the, on the lawn or whatever. But I may go to that. I really doubt it, to be honest. But I need to study, so I'm probably just gonna stay home. But I'll let you know if I change your mind. Hello, I'm off work. It's much later. This lighting is very weird. Hopefully that's not too much lighting, but yeah, I'm just off work. Um, I just got off like 30 minutes ago. I get off at six and I came home and I had so many um, Amazon packages. So I'll show you quickly a few things that I got for the baby. Nothing for myself. Actually, my baby shower dress did come in. And, um, I'll show y'all that tonight because I'm going to try it on tonight because my baby shower is in two days and I need to make sure that fits. And then somebody sent me a wrap. I'm so excited for this wrap. Are you kidding? Love that. And then some body wash. Oh, I also got these from Willa Tree. I'm obsessed. I'm wearing these tomorrow. To work and then somebody sent me this is so funny a little salt and pepper oh there's two in here i can give mom one she might not need it she has a kitchen at work but you can do a little salt and pepper and then put it in your lunch box that's genius that is genius i mean who wants to bring the whole like salt and pepper shaker you know what i mean this this lighting is kind of killer right now so i think i'm gonna adjust and cook some supper even though the only groceries i have is chicken that's so boring I have chicken and like frozen carrots that's depressing see my problem is i would rather spend money to get my nails done than actually buy groceries now tell me how mature that is i mean i have groceries i mean i have macaroni in there or something but i want like something else you know what i mean anyways i'm gonna fix supper and then let you know what i do next Okay, it's the next day. I don't know when I even last video, but it's Friday morning and I'm about to go to work, but as soon as I get off work, I'm going home for the weekend, clearly, like, uh, not clearly. Um, my baby shower is this weekend, so this is the dress that I ordered for it, and I still haven't opened it to see if it would fit just because I'm lazy. So, we're going to open it and see if it fits, because if not, I have nothing to wear. so pretty i mean i knew that but like oh my goodness oh my goodness i hope it fits so bad Ooh, it smells like a pepper or something oh my goodness i love it i wish you could see the lighting like how pretty the colors are I'm so glad I stuck I stuck with what I normally wear. It's a medium because I didn't know whether to size up or whatever because that last one I got a medium and it didn't fit, but it's just a maxi dress. Look at all Mally's toys. Um, it's just a maxi dress and I just love, I love it. Oh my goodness. I'm so happy. The lighting is horrible over here, but I wish I could show y'all like full length what it looks like. Yeah, you can't see, but. I love it. I'm so excited. 
Hello, it is much later. Actually, not much later. I just got off work. I got off at two and I'm about to drive home. So I thought I would end out the video here. Just eating some Pringles. Molly's eating. I just ate lunch, okay? And the whole time I'm eating lunch, she just lays here. And then now that I'm getting ready to leave, she wants to eat and I'm like, could you have not done that a minute ago? Like, come on. So as soon as she gets done eating, we're gonna load up and head home and have a good weekend. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.